take it on the road with the U.S. Hot Rod Monsters as they invade the Midwest this July. Terre Haute's getting ready for a battle royal July 16th and 17th at Vigo County Fairgrounds when the Monster Jam Summer Slam World Tour comes to call it. Log on now at PaceMotorsports.com. Get tickets today. A lot of people are having a great time here in Indy. Time now for our Jargon Jam. When you do this big, giant freestyle wheeling, you land and pogo it on the back wheels and just try to ride it out a little bit and, and know that it's just an awesome feeling knowing that you're inside that truck and you are in control of that vehicle 100%. I like to pull up to the cars and just crack second gear and stand it straight up. I mean, I've set it down on the back bumper lots of times to where it should have rolled, but it didn't. You get into a pogo situation where you stuff the front end, you know, it wants to stand right back up on you. You can pogo it on the rear tires, you can pogo it on the front tires, and sometimes you can pogo it on the side of the tires also. Now, you can get real wild and fly down in there to it, put it up and bicycle it on two wheels, and you have to settle down. Your other guy's just going to motor right on by you. Like Bender, that's when we do wheel stands. We like going to the cars and doing these real high wheel, front end wheel stands. Usually when we go carried tar away a little bit too far, we do a flag bender. And that's when we go out back, almost backwards and bends the flag up and costs a little bit of money, but it looks really cool. Yeah, it does. Folks here in Indianapolis love it. What about the crashes? Uh, how tough is that in this sport? Well, let's hear from some of the drivers. Okay, when you get into these crash deals, you know, like I always like to say is, you know, it happens in a slow motion. I've been lucky. I've been lucky for two years now. We haven't had any major rollovers due to the fact that we got to put this girl back together ourselves. I'm a one-man team. We got to go out here, me, myself, and I, and take care of this thing. So when you go out there and roll a truck over, it's almost like pulling a cash register. It's ching chings costing your money. My situation is, you know, we got a low budget. We're trying to keep this thing up. We do good for what we have, and crashes are only going to take away out of my hip pocket. And as you all like to see out here, these fans, everybody, they want to see good races. Yeah, they want to see crashes. There's guys out here that are, that are known for crashes. Well, we like to keep ours standing up tall. I know you guys will probably enjoy this crashing and burning. That's what the fans want to see. We don't always like to do it. I think it's cool. I like to have, like, the number one rollover out there, but I don't intentionally go out and roll the truck over, and the crew guys sure don't like it. They hate to see me tear that truck up, but you guys will love this. crashes pick up your copy of crash madness video at any pace motorsports monster jam including the big one in st louis on april the third coming up on tnn's motor madness we got more crashes we got a dim 